How's it going guys? I know it's been a while since I've uploaded on this channel, but we finally have a new product to review by AXA, or however you pronounce this. Basically, this is another mini projector, very similar to the last projector we reviewed by Emoten. This is another mini portable projector. We're gonna be taking a look at this new one that is also native 1080p. The actual name is the P400 Short Throw mini projector. So let's start things off with unboxing and then we'll take a look and see how good the actual screen quality is. All right, so of course we got to go over the features real fast. Luckily for us, it's all in the box. 30,000 hour LED, 400 LED lumens, up to 180 inch screen, onboard media player, digital AV input, two hour battery life. And then they, they already mentioned that one, but it's there again. And then on the back here, they give us some of the details. So one thing to note here is that it is actually a native 1080p projector. A lot of projectors claim to be 1080p, but they're upscaling to 1080p. They're not native 1080p. All right, so those are the most important numbers on this box. Let's go ahead and unbox this. I literally just put a ton of lotion on. I'm struggling. All right. Let's see what we got on the inside. We got some foam, keep it safe. Then we have the manual and some warranty paperwork. It looks like here we have a big power brick, like DC power. They give us this little projector stand, which is kind of neat. Since it is a portable projector, that's kind of important, so that's cool. The remote. And then of course, the actual projector. It'd be pretty disappointing if we opened this and there wasn't a projector. This thing is so small definitely is smaller than the last projector i reviewed all right i'm gonna take this out not elevated because i don't want to break it all right so i finally figured out how to take it out here is the projector this is the smallest projector i have ever seen in my life oh my just just for perspective this projector the moten right here this used to be small this is a small projector now look at this even smaller oh my gosh this thing is small but it feels solid all right so now we got to get to the actual review so i'll see you guys in a couple of days after i've watched a few movies on here maybe the new thor movie we'll see what it's like and how the sound is and i'll let you guys know what i think about it so i'll see you guys in a couple of days all right guys now that we have this out of the box let's take a closer look at it so on the front here you guys can see the actual projector lens then you guys got speakers all over this thing for actually decent sound but what i do is i hook this up to my jbl charge 3 because that portable speaker is amazing and i do that with this headphone jack right here so you also have your hdmi in you just have one of them and then your focus ring right there a reset button your dc power in then your on and off switch whenever you guys are using this as a portable projector Back here, it looks like we got a mini SD card reader. And then on the side, we have a powered USB, which does work even when you guys are just using the battery in here. So you guys can plug your fire stick straight into here and power it all off of the projector while it's unplugged. Then right here, you guys have this cool little button design and they're like touch sensitive, but you guys also get the remote. The remote's nothing special, but it does its job. But yeah, without any further ado, let's go ahead and take a look at how well this thing performs in a dark room. All right, guys, here is the mini projector. This is what it sounds like while it runs. Definitely sounds similar to the same noise a gaming PC would make running full blast. And here is what the screen looks like right now. I would say this is right around 100 inches and it is bright. I'll turn the light on here in a second so you guys could see just how bright this projector is. But in a fairly dark room, this thing is beautiful and crisp. So while you guys are looking at this, you'll see the texture of my wall. But the closer we get, it's still very difficult to see actual pixels. Even from here, that looks stunning. And you can see just how detailed the car is as well. All right, so next, let's turn on the light switch. And you can still see it. Keep in mind, projectors really aren't supposed to be used in lit conditions. But even in here, you can still see what's going on. A lot of projectors I have reviewed, you won't even see that. It would almost be as if nothing's there. So that really says something for this little projector. It's crazy, this thing is very small. If you guys look at it compared to my hand there, I mean, it is tiny, yet it still can produce a really big screen that's bright and detailed. As you guys can see here, I have my fire stick hooked up 
And the nice thing about this is you could just use it off of this USB right there. You don't even have to plug it in. All right, so real fast, I'm going to unplug the projector. All right, so this is really what I wanted to try on here. I just unplugged the projector and right now I only have the fire stick hooked up. And as you guys can still see here, it's running. All right, so of course we're getting some YouTube ads, but oh well. So that's really cool. This projector is powering the fire stick all by itself right now on its own portable battery. That is really sweet. All right guys, so that is my review for this projector. If you guys are interested in buying this, I have an affiliate link down below that won't cost you any more money, but it does help support this channel. And that basically wraps up this video. Make sure you guys like and subscribe and I'll see you guys on the next one.